This is your News 4 update, powered by the Bomarito Automotive Group. Good afternoon, everyone. Thank you for choosing News 4. I'm Claire Kelly. Here are some of the stories making headlines. A St. Louis County attorney is threatening to file a lawsuit if St. Louis County extends its stay-at-home order again. Attorney Beavis Schock represents the owner of a gym in Manchester, Anytime Fitness. They say the county and St. Louis City are bound by law to follow the guidelines set by the governor of Missouri. Governor Mike Parson says he will begin reopening the state on Monday, May 4th. The governor has said local communities do have the right to impose stricter orders, but the attorney says that is wrong. He is threatening to file that lawsuit on Monday. St. Louis County now has a new police chief, and she is making history. Lieutenant Colonel Mary Barton was sworn in this morning. She is the county's first ever female police chief. She replaces Chief John Belmer, who served as chief for six years. Firefighters now keeping a close watch on an auto salvage yard here in the Metro East after a large fire broke out today. Take a look. Powerhouse Sky Zoom 4 was above the scene at 830 this morning. We could find several cars on fire. This is on Buncombe Road in Washington Park. Thankfully, no reports of any injuries. As we check in now with meteorologist Megan Danahe, quite a contrast from the weather that we had yesterday. Yeah. No more rain, lots of sunshine. <laughs> and wind, wind <laughs> probably whipping those flames around that we just saw in the video. It was windy yesterday, it is windy again today, but yep, we've got that sunshine, which is quite nice. We have a lot of sun as the low pressure is moving away. It's what brought clouds and rain to us yesterday, but it is still windy because the low pressure is nearby, high pressure is building in, and we're kind of caught between these two systems. That's how you get such gusty wind. So it's going to stay windy with a few gusts up around 35 miles per hour today, but we will see plenty of sunshine. High temperatures a little bit warmer in the mid 60s. Nice evening as well. Clear skies at 9 o'clock. Temperatures back down to around 60 degrees. Tomorrow starts off cool again. We wake up to 40s, a high of 74. As we get into Saturday, it's even warmer. A warmer start in the morning, 57, a high of 83. We'll see a chance of showers and thunderstorms Saturday night late into Sunday. Megan, thank you, and that's your news for update. Remember, we are always online at KMOV.com and your KMOV News app.